What's up guys, Coach Austin here with your Orange Theory workout tip of the day. And we're on the TRX and we're gonna talk about a TRX pull-up. Definitely one of the most challenging TRX exercises that are out there. It takes a lot of upper body strength to be able to pull yourself from a down low position to come all the way up and onto your feet. If you feel like you're somebody who can't do this exercise very well, all hope is not lost. One of the best things about TRX is that TRX allow you to modify exercises depending on your fitness level so that you can still get the most out of the exercise by modifying it to a certain degree. Now this one is a little trickier than usual to modify though, but if we're able to be very aware of our body position throughout the movement, a lot of you out there are gonna surprise yourself in your ability to actually be able to do this move. Because one of the most common mistakes with this exercise is not being aware of our leg position. When you're starting off the movement, the first initial pull should be a pull forward with your arms and your back muscles. But what a lot of us end up doing is instead of pulling ourselves forward, we just straighten up the legs. We go from this legs bent position to kind of a bridge position. And from here, there is, there's no hope in getting up. Even the strongest people out there, I mean, that is, that's a really hard position to get up from. So instead of extending our legs up, we really want to initiate the movement by almost thinking about a roll forward. It's a pull and roll. Almost as if you're gonna throw yourself forward and into the wall. We wanna use those arms and back muscles to pull our momentum while keeping the bend in the knees the exact same. So notice the bend in my knees here. As I pull forward, the knees still stay in the same bent position. And I'm just rocking myself forward onto my feet. By doing that, once you get yourself flat-footed, from here you can actually use your legs to help you out and push to the very top of that movement. And that is where that modification comes in. Because those that are really strong, especially in their back and their triceps, aren't gonna have to use their arm, their legs very much to power up to the top. But if you're still trying to build up the strength in the arms and your back, you're gonna have to use your legs a little bit more to go from this part of the move up to the top. But your legs are a lot stronger than your upper body is, and thus they'll be able to help you get through that movement. So remember to focus on that very first initial pull. We want to pull and roll and then come up to the top. We don't want to extend our legs first thing, because if you do that, there's no way you're getting up. So give that technique shift a try, and I bet you you're gonna surprise yourself with your ability to do that exercise. So with that, be mindful, be aware, give your best, forget the rest, get out and get it done.